And a cloudy early afternoon now across eastern Oklahoma. We're going to keep the clouds going here for a time. If you live west of Tulsa, you will see a little bit of sunshine as we move through the afternoon hours here in Tulsa. Late afternoon sunshine will be possible east of Tulsa. More than likely, you'll see cloud cover into the evening hours. Now, here's a live look at our Buffalo Run Casino downtown camera looking back to the south. And again, plenty of cloudiness right now over the Tulsa area. 34 degrees and a light wind, so it's a cold early afternoon. And these temperatures will continue to warm into the upper 30s, maybe reaching 40 degrees just on the western sides of Tulsa if we see a little bit of that sunshine late today. Where we are seeing the sunshine, temperatures have warmed into the upper 30s from Stillwater over to Oklahoma City, also in the Seminole area. Most of eastern Oklahoma under that cloud cover, though, temperatures low to mid 30s. We're at 31 in Coffeyville, 32 in Grove and Tahlequah, currently 34 in Muskogee. So we're going to keep the clouds going through the afternoon, but by late afternoon again, we will see some of the clouds breaking here along Highway 75, more sun west, more clouds to the east. Otherwise, just a light wind out there throughout the afternoon, and temperatures are only going to warm into the upper 30s to around 40 here in Tulsa, a little cooler off to the east, where we expect more cloud cover through the rest of the afternoon, 37 in Grove and Jay around Grand Lake 35 degrees today up in Coffeyville while to the west where they're seeing some sunshine now more sun for the rest of the afternoon temperatures warming into the low to mid 40s out across north central and central Oklahoma about 46 this afternoon in Oklahoma City 45 Stillwater and 44 up in Ponca City then for tonight we will see partly cloudy skies we'll see winds relatively light and temperatures dropping below freezing once again into the 20s to around 30 degrees a little colder in some of the valley areas especially up around Bartlesville and Washington County at 25 27 at Coffeyville 29 here in the city. You know, it's 31 for around Bristow, also in the Okmulgee and Henrietta area. So it will be a cold start tomorrow morning, but again, a couple degrees above that average low. So this is what we normally would see this time of year with these cold temperatures during the overnight and early morning hours. But a nice warm up on the way. If you're ready for some of this cold weather to move on and see some improving conditions, we will see that 53 tomorrow after that cold start tomorrow morning, 54 on Wednesday. You notice we will see partly cloudy skies and a south wind Tuesday, light southeast wind on Wednesday. So looking good for the middle parts of the week. Thursday, temperatures holding in the mid 50s. We'll see a weak cold front that will move across the area. It's going to shift our winds around to the north, but it's going to hold our temperatures in the mid 50s. A nice warm up on Friday in advance of a strong cold front that will move through during the late evening hours on Friday. Temperatures upper 50s to around 60 degrees. And with that front moving in, there will be a chance for showers, especially during the evening hours on Friday. Looks like most of the morning and afternoon should be dry, but as moving into the evening, better chance of rain. Then that rain could mix with and change over to some light snow later on Friday night and a 70% chance of light snow right now. Now on Saturday with highs only at 31 degrees and Aaron look at that morning oh. low on Sunday morning 13. <laughs> so well, we're going to talk about nice mild weather moving in and just when we start to enjoy it. Then here comes winter back with a bitter cold shot. And again, we're going to be keeping an eye on this storm mm -hmm. system as it gets closer and we'll have another update coming up tonight at five and six. Man, I thought I was cold this morning. Yeah, it's going to get colder. <laughs> it's going to get colder. It sure is. All right. Thanks. All right. Jeff.